Okay, how do momentary switches act in concert with the water pump control to power our water pump? Well, this is the brains of the operation right here. This is the water pump control. All it is is a latching relay. I have one right here. We'll set it up in a few minutes. All it is is a latching relay. Now we have to get into the mode of understanding what load is. A load is anything that has its circuit completed by this relay. So the load can be the water pump. The load can be a timer. The load can be a light. Anything that has its circuit completed by this latching relay. Now the load is the negative leg of the circuit. This particular, how this particular latching relay works is it's connected to battery. It's connected to ground. And then there's a switch or a trigger. And all this trigger does is it allows this relay to close the circuit between the ground and the load. Okay? That's how this works. Now here's our water pump. This says pump, but it really means load. Power comes in to the, the um, module from the battery. It's fused. The water pump is also connected on the positive side to the battery. It's grounded. And then the negative side is connected to the load of the switch, which is here, load. And then you have momentary switches. So when you push the momentary switch, It connects the ground to the circuit, triggers the relay to connect the circuit between the ground and the load, and the water pump comes on. It stays latched. It's a latching relay. And the water pump will stay energized until the next time you push, push the momentary circuit. It will unlatch this and disconnect the load from the circuit. All right, that's how it works.